cause you couldn't keep it solid. Funny how they link up with your ops when y'all fall out. But I'ma let y'all have that bum shit while I ball out. Don't have a fuck to give about you hoes, bitch, I'm all out. Cross them right out of the picture like a fucking crop out. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Sass, and I'm back with another one straight facts. If you haven't already, make sure you drop those comments down below. Subscribe to this channel. Make sure you hit the bell on the side to get notified when I grab post. And last but not least, make sure you like this video up. Like this one, this one, this one, the last one, and the last one before that. Get a subscribe for me and for the whole team. So, as you guys can tell by the title, I, I am about to graduate <laughs> tomorrow. Y'all probably will see this, like, a couple of days after my graduation. And then I still, no, y'all probably gonna see this a long time from now. Because I still gotta film my Q&A, which I haven't already. I haven't did. But, um, I graduate on May 14th. Um, Friday, tomorrow. And this is just a pre-vlog. I had to my hair. My bell. Huh? A bell. Your bell? Where is it? That's my guy, child, y'all. But, um, yeah, so I did that. And I do my makeup. I probably vlog. If I, I'm, hopefully, I get up in enough time. But if I don't, um, then I'm going to just show y'all in the car on my way to graduation. Um, cause yeah, I gotta get up. I gotta be there for seven, so they mean I gotta get up like at five thirty to do my makeup. I'm only doing my eyebrows and put some lashes on. I'm looking at this Um, and I probably I'm, I don't even know. I might just do lashes, but yes. This is my cap i didn't show y'all and then this is my makeup i just did all uh, the eyebrows and lashes and lip gloss that's it but um about to see if i got any excess glue and pull off because it's already 6 45. This one acting, this side acting crazy. But yes, I'm um y'all don't mind me. <laughs> I'm making sure this thing ladies' hairs. And then yeah, so it is my big graduation day, and I'm excited. Y'all got this thing on to leave my um my edges. I should have bought my bag of brushes, but it don't look bad. I'm excited, I'm ready to go. So yeah. So yeah, y'all, the thing that's going to kill me is that these fucking school zones killing me. Oh, I like this makeup. Yeah, girl, did this. Oh, <laughs> but yeah, um, I can put some, lip, some, um, moisturizer on my face for these bumps. Okay, I went to a dermatologist, um, to see what is wrong with my fucking skin because it is breaking out real bad, like, all right here. Um, and so I got prescribed so much medicine, on, not only for my face, but for my eczema. So, I wanted to put some gum in. But, um, yeah, so, um, what I'm about to say, yeah, so, hopefully this on my, this on my face should be clearing up soon. I gotta turn off this street because these school zones gonna get me, for real, for real. Cause I ain't pushing for time, but I'm I'm pushing for time. Like if you know what I mean. I left a good a good amount of time. My school is only yeah, that should be killing me. But my school is only about ten minutes from where my best friend stay at. It's only ten minutes if all the lights is green and these fucking school zones. Cause I gotta remember this shit. Like look at this shit. There you go. But this is a video. This is going down in the books. Y'all already know. I'm gonna spray, spray some perfume. My um gown a little wrinkle because I didn't do a mama see and hang it up. But it's gonna do. I love cute per usual. The next day. What's up, y'all? It's your girl Sass, and I'm back with another one. Straight 
facts if you haven't already make sure you drop those comments down below subscribe to this channel subscribe to my channel the life of sassy is gonna pop right there and all i gotta do is subscribe hit that subscribe button make sure you tell your mama your daddy your uncle your brother your cousin all that in between your friends they friends anybody that you come across at the store say y'all let me see your phone right quick just say x just tell them just tell them let me see your phone right quick uh, ask them do they got YouTube. I know most people, most people be on YouTube, but some people, the thing about it is some people don't have, like, Google account. And I know, like, um, they just, like, listen to the music or whatever. But, yeah, ask them to see their phone. Type in Life of Sassy, L-Y-F-E, together, space, you're gonna put, you're gonna put the words together, L-Y-F-E of, O-F, space, Sassy, S-E-S-S-Y. Do that for me. And for the whole team but i am continuing my little vlog i don't know if i'm gonna put this before or after i don't know but you'll see when i edit it but i am i was supposed to do an updated q a before i did my graduation vlog so i probably put this after or before i don't know but um since i i ended up selling my camera because i'm going to purchase a new camera so i ended up selling my camera and I shipped it out last week or the week before that. I think the week before that. So I'm vlogging off my camera. I mean, my phone. I am vlogging off my phone and I'm going to ask. Well, I was asked a few questions on my Instagram. Um, my Instagram is the gorgeous underscore sassy two underscores after that. That is my Instagram. Y'all can follow me. Follow me and all that. Y'all get all the juicy content or whatever. First question is where is the last place you would ever go? um the last per the last place i will ever go i want to go to some type of island so i don't know if i'm going to go to bora bora or dubai or fiji or um santorini greece i want to go to some type of island and just just enjoy the whole experience and i want to go with some thousands some thousands of dollars because i want to be able to do whatever i want to buy whatever i want i want to be able to explore um you know they got little different things that i have been seeing um that you can do in those type of islands that are different massages um enjoy the beach jacuzzi the water all kinds of stuff i just want to do that um the next question is what is your favorite video um, I'm not sure if this pertaining to YouTube or pertaining pertain, pertaining to my dance videos. I'm not sure, but if it's dance videos, I will say I got a lot of dance. I got a lot of a lot of, and it's 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 a couple of videos that I haven't even recorded. But I would say the boot challenge that I'm always doing and the one that I haven't recorded, which is um, fucking with me by Tink. Um, I haven't recorded, but I had been did the video. I had been been made up this dance last year, but I just never did because I just been so busy this semester. Um, favorite song, my favorite song as of right now, um, my to go song is Tiana Taylor, um, made it, um, and it's because it just describes me and what I have been going through the past semester the past couple of months um what other song is my to-go song that i always listen to i like rye wave i listen to a lot of rye wave i like dirt oh what i cannot forget all love all love i don't care how old it is i don't care how new it is all love and internet sensation by love dirt that's my shit i all love i listen to that song every day every day um it's okay i had did an assumption too but nobody participated in my assumption but only one person um in the assumption was you can fight my assumption the assumption was you can fight um yes i can fight um i don't put that out there because i'm not that type of person anymore i try not to let people get me to that point for my cough but i try not to let people get me to that point of me having a fight now but it do come out of me and um yeah it do come out of me i ain't even gonna lie but um i haven't had a fight in a while and it said have you have you been in a fight recently um no i haven't i haven't i haven't been in a fight i would say in the last five or six years six years i probably say six years um because one i haven't had nobody try me two is i'm too old to be sitting there fighting and three is i'm not gonna i've been working on myself too much to let somebody get me to that point of me having to fight nah nah not that disrespectful type shit that talking and shit like if it ever get to that point and we in each other face and you 
bitch this, bitch that, fuck you, this, this, all this. I don't do that. So, my quick reaction, if I feel like you about to hit me, I'ma just hit your ass first. So, that's me. But, I don't do that. I don't, I don't do that anymore. Um, what is the last compliment you have got? Yo, this morning. And I don't know I was looking tore up. Look, look at my car broke. But I know I was looking tore up this morning. And I... I'm going to get back into praying every morning, sitting outside and catching the breeze and enjoying the breeze. Like I said, I always sit in my car. But um, this morning, I know I was looking to toe up. I had just woke up, didn't brush my teeth or nothing. I had went outside, I had my speaker, and I was just listening to my little, my little music. And a whole truck had stopped in the middle of the street and said, he got the call. He was like, how you doing? My name Austin. I'm like, okay. He was, I think he about to ask for directions or ask me something because they have like a, a little catering place right next door. Um, they they do catering dealing with like sweets, like desserts. They do a lot of cookies. And I think he about to ask him something like that. He going to say, you know, you are very pretty. You are really pretty. He was like, you know, you should take my number down or whatever. He was like, I'm going to be at work a couple of more hours or whatever. And then after that, maybe we can go out to eat. He was like, you drink? I was like, nah. He was like, you eat? He was like, um, you eat? You do? You you go shopping or whatever? We can go out and go shopping or I can get you something, something or whatever. I'm like, ah, I'm good. I'm good. But I, I put his number. Like, you know how, like, you about to type somebody and you, like, you about to save the contact? Y'all, is hot. But you know how, like, you about to save the con the contact? I didn't say, I put the number in, I put his name, but I didn't press save. So I just turned the phone over and he was like, you should call me sometime. I'm like, okay, nice seeing you or whatever. And then like, he just, I, I sat outside for a little bit. I'm like, let me go my ass. Is this why I can't never just sit outside and enjoy myself? Because it's always something like that. But that was the last compliment. He said, um, you know, you're very pretty. Um, my best friend asked me this. If you had to choose... If you had if you had to choose in between Barbie and Bretts, what would it be? Bitch, a Bretts all day. Oh, uh, my name ain't Sasha for no reason. It's like I don't, I don't even tell people my real name, but uh, it ain't no secret though. But I don't, my name ain't Sasha for no reason. Um, Sasha is one of the Bretts dolls, and when I was growing up, I had Bretts everything. I had a Bretts scooter. I had a Bretts comforter. I had a Bretts pillowcase. I had the Bretts the little. The little mannequin head they have the little nails and they had the dog the mannequin head i had all of that oh it is high up my name call back on it it is high i try i tried the natural heat um it say it say um favorite favorite city besides atlanta um i would say california i would say la 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 or miami I haven't been to either one of them, but I want to, to see which one out my, my to go. But I would say, I don't know, I would say at least. Um, it say Hulu, it say Hulu, but it just say Hulu. I don't know if it's meant, what's my favorite show on Hulu or what, I don't know what that was, what that was pertaining to. But my favorite show on Hulu, I watch a lot of things on Hulu, but um, I watch a lot of um, Law and Order SVU special victims unit that's my shit all day every day that is my to-go show i love svu alone all the svu that is my to-go show um and i have my hulu connected to stars so i do watch a lot of um like reruns of power um and star um the the tv show star i used to um i used to watch like reruns of that that's my shit um it say your favorite netflix show right now um, my favorite Netflix show that when I worked at my old job, one of these, these girls put me on, but it's, it's old, but I don't really watch Netflix like that because I feel like Netflix be trying me. Like, I be going on there for some good shit and I be having no good shit on there. So, um, somebody put me on Lucifer and it took me like a first two episodes to get into it, but that shit fire as hell. And I've been waiting for the, um, waiting for season, I think six to come out. And what I like about Lucifer is the the episode, the seasons are the the seasons are long. Like they have season one, and they got maybe twenty five episodes. I know season two had like twenty six or twenty seven episodes. That shit's so good. But my favorite movie so far has been on that. I like all of like the black movies and stuff like that. they had deuces they had true to the game i like all of those but the most recent one i had watched was brain on fire and it, it related to 
me because I deal with those type of people when she would have went the the symptom that she suffered with I deal with those type of people in my job now um and I, I cried I cried I cried baby um the next one said are you afraid of love no I'm not afraid of love I want to find true love I want to find I I, I believe in love and I believe in true love you know um if it's meant to be it'll be um and I believe that everyone has that their spouse that's just for them like even if y'all you know they say opposites to track and you will be like you'll look and be like damn you would have never thought i would have never thought this person would have went with with him or her but i feel like that is what it is but i don't know looking at me like bitch how she is park but yeah um so yeah i do believe in no i'm not afraid of love so yeah i'm not afraid of love i want to find my true love soon but these niggas is fools they fools they they they, they crazy um the next one said are you no the next one says when you get your place will you be taking lana and anaya for those who don't know lana and anaya is my two god children that is my babies that's my heart those are my babies <laughs> but it says um when you get your place will you be taking lana and anaya for some weekends of course that is my main goal i want to take my babies out i'm trying to get somewhere where they got a pool at um, so we can go swimming because my they love swimming. They love going swimming. So I want to get a place where they have some, and I love swimming. Um, look at my um my my zodiac sign, but I love swimming. Um, so yeah, I will have my babies a lot. Um, until I get my own, and even when I get my own, it say how is apartment searching going? It's going great. Um, I'm narrowing it down to two to three apartments that I have been looking at. Um, I will be going to look at some this upcoming week. I need to tour them, but I'm not rushing to move in. Maybe the end of the summer or not even the end of summer. Maybe like the beginning of August is when I actually plan on moving in. The next one, it says, <laughs> she paid for this, but it says, what's up with Circle K? Circle K is, if you know, then you know. If you know, then you know. So it was a guy that I, uh, I don't know, every time at these gas stations. But I ain't gonna lie. Like I said, me, I'm not afraid of rejection. I'm not. So if I find you attractive, I'm gonna go approach you. And that's just that on me. So um, it was a guy that I saw, and I'm like, damn, hey, hey, you all right, you all right. And Circle K is a little place I go out, you know, stall time when I don't feel like going inside. I sit up, sit, in, go give me a little, uh, a little, the little eighty nine cent drinks or whatever, and I sit outside and watch, get on my phone and shit like that. And I just kept seeing, I'm like, I'm like, so one day I just was like, you know, I'm like, you was real handsome. He's like, oh, you couldn't know. And then the rest is history. But what's up with him is for me to know you to find out. That's that's the answer. Um. It said, do you ever want to leave NOLA? Yes, I do. I wanted to leave, like, now. Right after I graduated, I wanted to leave, like, right after. But it so happened to be that I had got two job offerings, and I accepted the two job offerings. they both part-time, and then I can make my own schedule, how I choose to fit. So, um, and they pay, pay very well. So, um, and it's what I graduated in. So, why not? You know, I was like, you know, I'm not in a rush, but I am kind of am. Uh, I kind of am because um, Louisiana, I feel like they don't support you like like I feel like it should be. Um, and it's a lot of a lot of things Louisiana lacks, and I just want to get away from it. Um, it's a favorite thing to do, of course. It is dance. I love to dance and I love to swim. I love like going places. Like I love going like vacation, the beach, swimming, dancing bowling the movies shopping anything i'm i'm such a girly girl i am and I don't, i'm not afraid to speak i mean i'm not afraid to speak um do you have an ideal partner um my ideal partner um i don't have i don't have a specific you know i don't have a specific partner who like my ideal partner but i would i do have some requirements so i would say um have to be goal driven goal driven um have a lot of support and positivity around them because i don't do that negative i don't do the negative and i have been trying to get rid of the negative i don't do that so 
um that goal driven um focus on the positive um and have positive and supportive people around them um very family oriented um now i ain't gonna say deeply in spiritual but you know we can at least pray together or you know have some type of foundation of who we seek in our relationship and that is the man above because I, without him uh it wouldn't be us um let's see who else um let's see what else um has to be handsome nice nice teeth um and good hygiene um of course they're going to be taller than me because i'm very small um so most guys are taller than me um yeah so yeah they um you know the all and all the other basics you know great communication or you know good in that area loyal honesty all of that that's stuff that you look for in relationships um let's see i two more questions what pisses you off what pisses you off or what's a pet peeve um attention seeking i said this in a long time ago q a but people who seek attention i hate that i hate that like can you can you be yourself because i feel like i am myself and i feel like you know i don't go out of my way to try to you know make it seem like i'm this perfect ass person i am who i am and that's who i am is why people love me you know who i am the outspoken I me mean, the outspoken the funny me the person that just say what it was on their mind the person that just love to have fun the just the overall go-getter the motivator the 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 peacemaker the counselor in the friendships that's that's who i am so you know i expect for people to be there around me not be fake and not be um attention seeking like you know people that like if we go out and they got a group of guys or whatever and this one fucking person gotta be like you know extra loud or bending over and shit trying to get their attention like bitch bitch bring your tent to a two okay bring your tent to a two like like oh i hate people like that like i mean ain't nothing wrong with it but it's a time and a place for it and you know as we get older you know let them come to us let them come to us you know how to do all of that um oh that pisses me off um describe your temper with a weapon this is a good one um i don't even know um a slingshot <laughs> i don't fucking know uh i don't know but my temper um, i don't know i don't know that's a hard one my temper is um how would i describe my temper um my temper is i don't know um but i know when i do have a temp when i i don't have, i'm not gonna say necessarily in my temper but when i get mad when i get mad i cry and not so no not so not necessarily meaning that you hurt my feelings um but pisces i do have soft feelings but in the midst of an argument i cry because i can't put my hands on you or something is preventing me from putting you so say like if 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 it's a family member i don't want to fight you like you somebody on the street because we family or you know something like that so i cry but then when i get to that point it's no like it's no turning back you know some, some people say they black out i don't really black out i just go to the extreme so like we fighting we fighting straight up like we fighting come on let's fight let's fight i don't do that talking that shit i don't do that because my nerves get bad and i be like but you wasting my time if we either we gonna fight or we not like what's going on like what's what's about to happen you know yeah so that's just me you know but like i said previously i try not to get to that point um but that's pretty much it i hope you guys enjoyed my video um like i said y'all y'all didn't see the ending but i got my diploma i'm waiting for it to come in because it just say um southern university um in agriculture and mechanical college but i'm waiting for my diploma to be mailed um and then i'll show y'all look it ain't coming out everything but 
I'll show y'all when I get my diploma. But I hope I thank you guys. Wait, <laughs> but uh, I hope you guys enjoy my video and my vlog from my graduation. Um, make sure you stay tuned for all the late content that I have on the way. Like I said before, make sure you tell your mama, your friends, and their friends to subscribe to Life of Sassy and come join the plush gang. Gang, gang. And until then, we out. You gonna let me come through this bitch? <laughs>